This week, we peer through the lens of Ben Schneiderman's camera to illuminate the human-human interactions that make the Kai community vital. Today, be generous. On the sidelines of Kai 2000 in The Hague, Jenny Priest interviewed Jacob Nielsen about his heuristic evaluation method for interaction design, the textbook that Priest co-authored. Nielsen is a bridge between the academy and industry. Meanwhile, interaction design is in its fourth edition. It's the entry point to HCI for many students, where they learn to be generous to their users. From this early start, it's the generosity to read and comment on colleagues' papers, the generosity to celebrate their work. This generosity propagates ideas, and it seems never to go out of style, though we can't help but notice the vintage late 90s technologies, paper, and an analog tape recorder. Elsewhere at Kai 2000, Priest and Blair Nonicki presented work on lurkers. I spoke with Priest by phone. What we were trying to say was give lurkers a chance. These are not just free riders. They're getting to know a community. Some of them may be taking and not giving, but most of them are not. And let's give them the benefit of the doubt. The benefit of the doubt is also being granted here as an audience of computer whizzes generously peers at Jeff Johnson's laptop while a projector stands idly by. This is a policy workshop before CHI 2006 in Montreal. Jeff Johnson. This crowd was always prone to trying techy, high-tech solutions to things. And often those high-tech solutions would, would fail or at least slow us down. Jeff went on to talk about the tension between the promises of teleconferencing and the fact that we're all here together in Denver, or the fact that Ben Schneiderman and Stuart Card shared these moments together at the tail end of CHI 2012 in Austin, and the student volunteers who appear in the background. Behind all the debugging, the coding, and the workflows, Jenny Priest still interviewed Jacob Nielsen in person, bringing the generosity of human-human interactions to the fore.